The NFL seems to be in a weird place with what exactly these offenses want to be and who they're looking for and yep. who's going to run them. Because I think one of the reasons why we've seen quarterbacks have success earlier on is because of some mobility. So the defense, Deshaun Watson, right? So the defenses have to prepare for more, yep. but at the same time, what is the longevity of these quarterbacks actually going to be? Exactly. That's exactly right. And Doug Peterson had comments towards longevity. He said longevity is everything in this business. Learn from the best. Learn from Tom Brady, who got hurt early in his career, and learn from guys that have done that and yet still went on to have great careers and long careers. So, Carson, we need you to learn that you can't play the game with your body. You have to play it with your arm and with your brain. And if need be, then you can do it with your body. Think of the best quarterbacks in the league this year who were also mobile quarterbacks who ended up hurt. Carson Wentz, Aaron Rodgers, yep. mobile quarterback, broke his collarbone, got out of the pocket. He got right. out of the insurance protection zone of that quarterback pocket. And what does he do? He's led to the Wolves who just feasted on him, break right. that collarbone, drug him down to the ground. And the game is built Andrew a little bit Luck. for those in the pocket, right? Yes. Like that, that's his, it's not a safe place, but it's, it's hell not of a safe, lot but safer. It's much safer. You can't go low and you can't go high. There's a strike zone on a quarterback. Yeah. They're going to get hit, but they also can't be slammed. Right. So there's longevity in the pocket for a quarterback. Look at Cam Newton, who is suspect if he was going to be able to come back from that labrum tear by being a mobile quarterback. So I would caution NFL teams looking at a mobile quarterback based on him being mobile. Yes, it does lend to more success at the beginning of that guy's career, but it also means that career is going to be shorter than you would hope from a franchise type quarterback. I don't think Cam Newton's going to make it all that long with the way he plays. Yeah, he's 6'5", 260 pounds, and he's bigger, stronger, faster than most guys on the field. But he's also very vulnerable. Carson Wentz, if his game doesn't adapt, he's going to continue to get hurt. Andrew Luck, does anybody have complete faith that he's going to return to old form this year? Not really. Why? Because he's had to run around like a chicken with his head cut off because he can. It's worked out nicely for him at the beginning of his career. But that game has to consistently and constantly evolve if you're going to achieve your potential. This certainly doesn't seem to be the Chargers plan, and I'm not going to let you escape today. No, I know. Because it, it doesn't, and, and you're right. I, I don't know what's going on in the Chargers quarterback room with who they're bringing in with exactly what we're talking about with injury. So isn't it quite telling what's been happening? Yeah, it's, like we don't want your kind anymore, Philip, Mr. Old Pocket Passer. That's right. Kind of, that's kind of what it seems like. That's the writing is on the wall for what the head coach Anthony Lynn is looking for out of that quarterback room.